tell a story, you activate all these centers, you stimulate all sorts of things in somebody else's brain. And you connect with them in this just very primitive, enduring way. So when you make yourself vulnerable, when you tell something that's really happened to you, you reveal a part of your experience, you draw on the other person's memories, and it, there's a shared connection. Um, so storytelling is a way I always tell people that you can be vulnerable, but also safe. Because the other person's gonna get it. They also have human experience. There's something, it doesn't have to be the exact same experience, because even two people who have the same thing happen to them have different stories they tell, they have different memories. Our memories are hugely unreliable, right? And they change based on the weather, on emotions, all sorts of things. But when you tell a story, you connect with other people. And when you learn how to tell your story, you'll connect with other people all the time, like when you least expect it, when you're pumping gas. And it just makes life much richer. So it's one of those cases where it's worth just learning those muscles. Everybody can learn to do it because we know how to do it innately. Like it's been unlearned, but it's easy to relearn because all human beings know how to tell stories.